Okay guys and welcome back to another edition of J Strategies. Today we're going to talk about the granddaddy of them all, Bitcoin. Right now Bitcoin's trading at 54,900. We had a massive dip in the market and this dip happened because of all the fun and all the stuff happening out there. But guess what? El Salvador Okay, they purchased more Bitcoin. You know, does that make sense to you? Now, let's look at the chart here. Okay, so we were riding, and this is on the four-hour chart. This is like one of the uh, one of the most important charts you can see out there. Now, we were riding in the middle of the middle of the Bollinger Band, and as soon as we tapped that, we had a nice flash crash. And when we exit the Bollinger Band bottom part of the band we ended up doing a bounce back so now we're gonna ride below this band for quite some times um and it's gonna take some recovery for us and some good news in the media for bitcoin to pull itself back up over 40k let's go ahead and look on the one hour chart right now it's about 2 2 uh, p.m eastern standard time for me and uh we're gonna pull out here now, you see, because of that flash crash, it pulled up that Bollinger Band towards the top, which then in turn moved this up. So, that's why you see here on this bounce, okay, where it ended up bouncing and coming back above that band, rode the band, and now it's below it. So, now we're fighting for this little area here. Now, my expectations would be we can either... Hit this middle and continue to dip lower and we would continue to get back to about the 46k range because that is possible. But if we see the bulls pick it up and go into a bull rally, we will see a short bull run back up to our 51, 52k range and then we need to hold the line there. So right now, unless there's going to be any kind of parabolic news... Right now, Bitcoin's trading sideways. Guys, let's just get out there and do what we got to do. Today in the whole market, Bitcoin down in seven days, 10%. Ethereum is up. Binance, Binance has been doing well. Binance has a lot of volatility. U.S. Tether, as always, you guys know all the stuff behind U.S. Tether. And Solano's made its way up pretty damn quick in the game here. And uh, me personally, in my own portfolio, I did buy some Cardano. So guys, go to your coin market cap, okay? Don't forget to go to my Twitter page. And on my Twitter page, I drop all of the news for the projects that I work on. Waroftribes.com and GoneWild.io. And I am also a strategic advisor, and we will continue to take these projects to the moon. You guys have an excellent day, and let's take our crypto all the way from there and beyond, and to the moon!